Asenko Sandwell used a simulation model to accurately determine the infrastructure requirements and operating costs of the Surat Basin coal chain. The model included 18 mines, two ports, five types of trains, and marine traffic at the port of Gladstone. The Surat Basin coal chain begins at the new Wandoan mine. Product from the coal processing plant is sent to a stockyard for storage. Product is later reclaimed from the stockyard and loaded onto waiting trains. Variation in train loading time caused by machine failures can delay other trains waiting to enter the mine area. Loaded trains then exit the Wandoan mine and travel along the new Surat Basin Railway until they join the existing single-track Maura system. The trains must compete for slots on the railway with current users of the system. If a slot is not available, trains wait at passing loops while the railway clears of traffic. Traffic increases near the port of Gladstone where the Maura system connects to the North Coast Line and Blackwater Rail systems. Once the trains have arrived at Gladstone, they move on to the Kalamonda Rail Yard where they are serviced and provisioned. From Kalamonda, trains travel to either the Gladstone Power Station or the RG Tana Coal Terminal. Any delays at the terminal impact when trains return to the rail system and how quickly they can service the coal mines. Most trains travel to RG Tana and unload their product into the stockyard. Product is later reclaimed by bulldozers and loaded onto ships at berth. When loading is complete, shipping delays for documentation and draft checks are applied. Ships then wait for high tide and for the channel to be clear of traffic before entering the channel. Inbound ships must also wait for the channel to clear of all departing ships before they enter. Over only five months, Osenko Sandwell created and validated the model, identified system bottlenecks, quantified the system performance, and determined the capacity of the system with incremental improvements. The optimum improvement path was identified by comparing capital costs against operating costs generated by the model.